Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back with another video. In this video, we're gonna do another reaction video, a scary ghost video, you guys. So in this ghost video, it's called five scary ghost video that will mess you up, bro. So hopefully it won't mess me up, man. So you know how it is, man. Sometimes it can be some crazy scary videos, man, like some paranormal activity videos or either it could be like a shadow ghost or clowns. People dress up as clowns, man. Like what? What the hell, man? And without further ado, you guys, man, don't forget to turn on those post notifications, you guys. Drop a like, subscribe, help me out, you guys. Thank you guys so much for helping me out, man. And, and if you guys are new to the channel, man, you guys are welcome by as well, man. So let's get straight into the video, all right, you guys? All right, good to go, man. All right, let's see what it is, man. Not five ghosts, caught on camera. The West Virginia Penitentiary. Ah. Uh -huh. The infamous West Virginia Penitentiary is one of the oldest prisons in the United States. Oh, wow. The sprawling fortress-like prison operated from 1876 oh, to 1995. It housed some of the world's most dangerous inmates. In fact, after mm. numerous horrifying attacks and homicides in the penitentiary, the U.S. Department of Justice named the prison one of the 10 most violent correctional facilities in the U.S. Wow. Almost 1,000 men lost their lives in the West Virginia Penitentiary. What? either by sickness, execution, or the frequent brutal attacks by fellow inmates. Uh, the wow. Farmer brothers Josh, Rocky, and Sean from people, the YouTube man. channel Paranormal Nightmare traveled to the small town of Moundsville to investigate the allegedly mm -hmm. haunted West Virginia Penitentiary. Right now we're here. Oh, so they went over there. Penitentiary. We're going to get started in the cell block area. All right. This area here is where they housed most of the violent inmates. Ooh, man. In 1986, a brutal creepy, attack by right? a fellow inmate ended the life of prisoner Red Snyder. Many claimed to have seen Red's ghost still wow. walking the prison halls. Red? Nuh-uh. Through? My name's Josh. This is Rocky and Sean. They were talking about you earlier today. That's him, right? That one of your friends brutally murdered you right here in this cell. Wow. Can you see us? Let us know if you're in here. Hmm. Man, I mentioned something in the appearance right there. Whenever I stopped, it stopped. Then I asked. Whoa, what was that bang, man? You heard that? I asked. Damn, that was a loud bang. Josh and Rocky Foreman head to the second floor cell block to do a spirit box session. Oh, no. They capture some very bizarre and unsettling responses. Let's see what he captures. Is this your cell? I'm no longer in prison. Whoa. What? Where are you at if you're not in prison? Are you free? Can you still hear us? Wow. Yes? Can you say Josh? Then say it. Say Josh. No, wait, he's not going to say his name. I heard you. The Foreman brothers reunite on the prison's main floor and are walking down the dark hallway. Oh, when shoot, suddenly man. Suddenly, they see this. Nah, uh -huh. I'm telling you, they seen the, the actual ghost, man. Awesome. The prisoner ghost. Dude, what Ooh, the freak, that? man? I caught that. Oh, Shadow. Oh, shoot. Shadow. Yo, he captured that, like, right there, man. A dark shadow wow. figure seems to just appear out of thin air at the end of the hallway. Whoa, that's then creepy, yo. Walks what out the of heck? Sight. This handle. It, it disappeared. Handle Holy shit. Wow. Go stand by, huh? This handle. That's insane, man. Yo, that's crazy, man. You can see on the video, Sean walks by. His shadow is cast on the inside wall. The Paranormal Nightmare team tries to debunk this bizarre shadow crazy, figure, dude. but they come up with no answers. Wow. So is this the ghost of one of the inmates who lost his life I mean, in the prison? I mean, it has to be, right? You decide. 
Over on their YouTube channel, Paranormal Nightmare TV series, you can check out more of the Foreman brothers and their paranormal investigation. I gotta check that out, man. Hider man. in the house. So let me know what you guys Chilean think, man. TikTok user Franco Viegas claims that lately odd supernatural activity has been occurring in his home. He says that he's seen unexplained shadows, experienced sleep paralysis, and most bizarre of all, he says that some unseen thing actually bit him Whoa. on the back. What? Franco decides to set up a small CCTV camera to record himself as he sleeps. No, what? Somebody bit him? It looks like a human bite mark too, man. What the heck? Oh man, what is that? Is that dust or is it like a mist? What is that? Oh shoot. No way, man. I mean, it, it could be a spider web. A blurry white figure seems to appear on camera. Damn, what Oddly is that? Oddly enough, man? whatever it is doesn't seem to upset or excite Franco's dog. It continues to sleep through the entire incident. Oh, Three wow. days later, oh. Franco's bedsheet is pulled off by. No, 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 no. But it doesn't end there. You gotta be freaking kidding me, man. Two days later, on April 30th, Franco Viegas starts to hear knocking on his bedroom oh, door. Oh my. No, what a... man. Son. Son las. Las una de la mañana, casi. Almost one a.m. Para ser concreto, como ven, no tengo audio ni ni música en el video porque nada, me golpearon la puerta muy fuerte, muy fuerte, wow. y estoy solo. Despertamos todos, todos los gatos y. Eh, how many cats you got? La puerta, así que voy a mover la cámara apuntando hacia allá. Oh man. Veremos mañana en la mañana o en la madrugada. So Franco changes the angle of the CCTV camera to point towards his door. Wow. Five days go by without incident. But on May 5th, as Franco sleeps, his security camera catches something truly chilling. Have we seen this guy's video before? The haunted apartment? Is it this one? I forgot, man. Oh, man, that's insane, man. The doors keep opening. It's like... Oh my no. Ooh. Yo, that ain't normal, man. No. Nope. No. Nope. The camera records Hell what seems no. to be the pale face of a girl peeking into Franco's room as he sleeps. And those eyes, look at it. In what the heck? Franco asks his TikTok viewers for advice on what to do about the strange spirit that seems to haunt his home. One viewer recommends an odd sort of seance, saying that Franco should try talking to the spirit while holding a candle in front of a mirror. Like Bloody Mary. Estoy solo acá del baño. Bueno, me dijeron que he traído una vela y un espejo y ahora voy a hablar con ella. It's not gonna end well. Amiga, por favor, te pido que me dejes solo. Te lo pido, por favor. What the? Ah, oh, shoot! Now I'm certainly not saying that this footage is real. But what makes it more compelling is that Franco clearly shows that the bathtub is empty, is empty? and that he's alone only seconds before the girl what? appears. One night, Franco is filming one of his cats playing, and what happens next is truly bizarre. Hay ruido en el primer piso. You hear noises. Oh, hell no, man. Cas right there. Ah, hey, hey. Ah, no way. What the freak, man? It disappears quick, man. Ah, So, is Franco Viega's house truly haunted, or is it all just an elaborate hoax? What do you guys you think decide. about that, man? You can follow Franco's continuing story over on his TikTok on. page. Let's see. All right. Out of step. You guys, man, you guys gotta let me know if it if it's real or if it's fake, man. I can't even tell, man. You know, at first it looks fake, right? But how can you guys explain that? Like, there's nobody there at one second, then the other second, there's somebody right there, and the guy trying to go chase like the ghost, trying to see like if there's actually like somebody right there. No, and it disappears, it vanished this quick. Like what? Like is that even possible? Yo, look this. Yo, let's get back to the video, man. TikTok user BetsanAngel69 is a 44-year-old mother of three that mainly uses her TikTok account to keep up with her older children. One day, when looking across the street from where she lives, 
she notices a mysterious figure pacing back and forth. Mm. She took a video of it and shared it with one of her friends. Do you see that? Where? Oh, wow. But how could you capture that, man? That's like... It, she haven't tell me that? Like, I couldn't even tell like what it is. Oh, man, I see it. It's like walking back and forth. Wow, it just keeps going back and forth. But what's it doing like that, right? What's it keep going back and forth like that? Dude. The next day, the figure is back again. It paces back and forth for hours on end. Bet thinks that whoever it is might have a mental illness, which would explain the erratic behavior. She records again, oh, he lost his watch. and this time posts the video on TikTok to see what other people think. Man, that's crazy, yo. But she sees it? Taya, get over here. Huh? I can't even zoom in any closer. You know, but you know what's the strangest thing is? like. You see it? Like, how could she see that? just walks back and forth back and forth back and forth is that somebody or is it ghost i thought it was a ghost in the comments on her tiktok bets and angel 69 gets many questions about the history of the location and some viewers even wonder if the event might be of a paranormal nature hmm. bet follows up with another video Okay, so everybody that's been <laughs> kind of curious, this is the church that's directly across the street from my house right. that I was explaining. Um, this is the area where we see that figure. It just walks okay, over back there. and forth every day, all day. Now, I've been over there a couple of times um, as I walk up on it. There's just nothing okay. there. Now, whoever or whatever the figure might be, it seems that Bet's dog is a little what? freaked out as well. It's really strange, man, because there's there's nobody there when she goes over there. And now the dog is acting up. Oh, no, nah, man. That's got to be like a ghost, man. I, you know, it's not a human. But she sees it. You know, this crazy thing is that she sees okay, it, buddy. too. When Bet sees the figure again, she decides to go take a look. But she's too oh, scared wow. to go alone. She brings her husband along, and they go to investigate. My husband has agreed to walk me over and see what we can find. And this crazy thing is, it's like literally like right in front of her house, you know? <laughs> I'm sorry. Here's the spot. Let's see. I don't no, I don't either. Oh, okay. I mean, it's pretty full. Hello? Is anybody there? Wow, so she I'm captured so that with her camera. That's really far away. What was that? Wow. I don't know. It's a good camera. Do you need help? <sighs> this is the moment uh, what we happened? turned and ran. I know it might not seem that scary on camera, but when we were up that close, it was so loud and it was just this almost guttural scream. Um, this is uh, the moment we heard it and ran. You can kind of see us back there. Oh, so she stopped the recording. And we took off. By accident. Huh. My poor husband was like, this he kept looking back <laughs> yeah um, he yo, he bounced i think at one point he was like tick tock i'm out of here this is done <sighs> now did bets and angel 69 capture a ghost stuck in a recurring loop could it just be some deranged person and nothing paranormal at all yeah that's or really strange is it man. all just a hoax let me know what you think i just check out bets and angels tiktok page to follow her continuing story the Watcher. Clueless, Ghost man. Ghost Hunting Channel, Polish... Well, you, you know what, man? But just let me know what you guys think about that. Personally, I think it could be real. Um, Maybe she sees something over there. Like, obviously that she sees something over there, but she can't tell what it is, you know, if it's a, an actual human or if it isn't like a shadow ghost, man, because it keeps going back and forth all day and the dog keeps acting up at night, you know, and dogs can't see something, you know. When they see something, they start barking. But, you know, who, like, who knows, man? 
But let me know what you guys think, man. All right? Let's go back to the video. Paranormal TV explores an allegedly haunted building deep in the woods near the city of Katowice, Poland. A dark history surrounds the location. Only a month prior to the investigation, the burned body of a homeless man was discovered by an unsuspecting hiker. Damn, Since wow. then, there have been rumors of weird and unexplained things happening to all who enter the abandoned house. Before Polish Paranormal TV start their investigation, mm. they check the grounds to make sure that they are completely alone. Oh, okay. Always a haunted, scary house. totally sami. Nie ma tutaj nikogo oprócz nas. Wchodzimy do środka. Dobra. Jak widzicie, budynek jednak jest w trochę w średnim stanie. Tylko w środku. Once inside the house, they immediately begin to hear strange noises. No, I don't know. Jeżeli jesteś tutaj z nami, daj nam znać. Będziemy wiedzieć, że jesteś i odejdziemy. Każdy odejdzie w swoją stronę. Już tu więcej nie wrócimy. Hmm. Now better mess too much many goals, man. It's always with the banded places, right? On on voice. Hmm. Hmm. What was that? Now, the guys laugh it off at first, but things get a bit more serious when they get a direct response to a question. No, no. Kolejną szansę, możesz się z nami skomunikować. Daj jakiś znak, że tutaj jesteś. Oh shoot. Kto tu jest? You know what's really scary, man? It's like it's the middle of nowhere. You know, he's with his buddy, but damn yo. This is really scary, man. I don't know, man. They keep hearing odd sounds around the house, but they can't find the source. But their YouTube viewers were shocked when they noticed this. Again with the noise. Unexplained whispering. Oh, shoot. Try here. Toto, yes. Whoa, what the freak, man? What was that? Did you see it? What the hell was that? The Polish ghost hunters didn't notice at the time or even point it out in their video. But someone seems to be walking around the corner just as they check the staircase. Oh, shoot. Oh. oh, oh, hell no. Damn, there is some, there's somebody there. Holy crap. Dang, it's really dark too, man. You know, this person is crazy, man. Now, it certainly could just be a homeless man in the building that came to check out the noise. But again, I remind you, before the investigation, the Polish Paranormal TV crew inspected the entire building to make sure they were man, alone. That's... So, what do you think? Is it a paranormal that's... entity or just a wandering homeless man? Let me know. A down homeless in the ghost. A quiet voice. Listen, you guys, I have no idea who that was, man. But if there were, if that was me, I would never return to that place ever again, man. Imagine just going inside the building, the coast is clear. Then you see somebody outside, man. Oh, hell no, man. You're No, 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 man. Hell no, man. Let's get back to the video, man. No.
Mm -mm. Popular YouTuber and paranormal explorer Ricky Velasquez frequently does live streams while exploring allegedly haunted locations in Mexico. In this live stream, Ricky and a female friend are exploring a haunted house in Ciudad Guzman, Mexico. They begin to hear what sounds like the voice of a little girl. They call oh. out to the child, and that's when things get truly bizarre. Yeah. Uh, no. ¿Cómo te you guys hear that banging noise? Yeah, we... Oh man, please don't, don't, yeah. don't call the ghost, man. I'm saying little girl. <laughs> oh, <laughs> shoot, hell no, no, no. <laughs> Screw that, hell no, 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 wait, no, hell no. Oh, my Hola. Man. He's talking to the ghost girl, man. ¿Te podemos ver? Niña. ¿Quieres que te veamos? Don't tell me you're not. Niña. Damn. This is spooky, oh. man. Yo no voy a correr. Niña. Chiquita. Déjanos verte. Oh, no. no te vamos a lastimar. Chiquita. Yo, this is like the movie, man. Chiquita, asómate. Mm -mm. Yo no la veo. Don't tell me she's gonna peek out, man. Oh! Oh! Ya la viste, ya la viste. Sí, sí, ya se la vieron. Ya la viste, la vi, la vieron. So, did Ricky Velasquez no, capture no, the ghost man. of a little girl on his live stream? What do you think? You can see the full investigation over on Ricky Velasquez's YouTube channel. Thanks for watching. To submit or suggest videos, email me at nukestop5 at gmail.com. And also for many random things. Listen, listen. Why would you call the ghost girl, man? Don't call that ghost girl, man. That's creepy, man. Man, what? Oh, man, I can't believe people call out ghosts, man. I don't know, man. That's way too much for me, man. Woo. But if you guys enjoyed this reaction, you guys, man, don't forget to drop a like, subscribe, and turn on the post notification. You guys, thank you guys so much for watching, and have a great and wonderful day, you guys. Thank you guys so much. Peace.